The Boolean function in JavaScript allows you to take a value and then convert it into a true or false value. As an example, you take an empty string, it's going to give you false, but a string with something inside of it is going to give you true. Also things like the number zero is going to give you false, but a positive number will give you uh, true. So this here actually has some really good use cases. I'm going to be going over those shortly, but for now, let's have a look at uh, how it actually works. I'm going to say here console.log then call the boolean function with a capital b then say empty string i'm also going to say here the number zero and also the value of false let's save this run the script and we get here three falses so of course you're going to get the value of false for all of these three values now let's look at a few more i'm going to say right here null and also undefined as well as not a number. Save it, run it again. Now all of these are also going to give you a value of false. Now there might be a few more, right, that give you false, but from my knowledge, these are the only ones that give you false. Everything else is going to give you true, okay? That includes empty objects and empty arrays. Now what are the use cases for this? Well, in TypeScript, sometimes it's going to complain if you have a type of Boolean but you try to provide an empty string, you need to convert that into an actual Boolean and not just the empty string because of course the string is falsy, but TypeScript wants a Boolean value. You've also got the filter method, okay? As an example, let's say const messages equal to, I'm gonna say null, I'm gonna say here hi dom, then say empty string, then say uh, hello as an example, right? So here, Null and empty string are not valid messages. They're actually falsy messages. So I can say const valid messages equal to messages.filter and then simply provide the boolean function without calling it right there. I can now say console.log valid messages and we can see that we're able to filter out the ones that don't resolve to uh, true in the boolean function we only get hi dom and hello and that is all for this video if this one helped you out make sure to drop a like and subscribe to decode and here is another video